Hello, everyone. It's uh, Ron back here, your favorite uh, uh, DJ, DJI Air 2S reporter here. Uh, I've already made a series of videos on this, and I'm continuing today. Um, I'm here in uh, uh, Vetner City, New Jersey. Uh, it's the southernmost town on the island I live on here at the uh, Jersey Shore. And um, we're going to go out for a flight here. Um, it was kind of rain this morning, uh, but the weather has cleared up somewhat today. I got some interesting clouds out here uh, today, and we're uh, about a half hour away from uh, sunset. So um, I hope to finally get some maybe uh, a sunset uh, flight with the uh, air to have uh, flown in, uh, you know, kind of the morning, middle of the day before. So we're going to see what it can do with this one inch sensor. Uh, can do in, in kind of some lower light conditions. We have some clouds up there, so hopefully we get something good tonight. I hope the clouds don't uh, block the sun. It's kind of like 50-50 right now, but uh, you know, with no uh, further ado, we will get this thing up here. And what we're going to do is we're going to film in the uh, the 5K, um, 5.4K uh, video this offers. We're just going to shoot normal video first, uh, use just everything on auto, and then we're going to you know switch over and shoot. Um, 5.4K um, log profile, you know, where I'll go back and I'll color grade it and everything in post and we'll compare uh, the differences in the two videos. And we'll try to get some photos up here, you know, some smart photos, uh, maybe a panel or so. So, um, you know, just to, uh, you know, sit back, uh, you know, get uh, get a beverage and a snack and, uh, you know, we're gonna go for a nice little flight here. We're even uh, filming the, uh, with the Hero 9 today, and we're filming that at 5K too, so this will be kind of a, you know, a, f a whole 5K workflow from action camera B-roll to the drone. Now, this is 5.4K, the, the Air 2S, and this is just straight 5K, but I don't know, you know, if I, what, what, what you know, 0. 0.4, what, what difference is that really? Mini, mini school. So, um, let's, um, you know, Let's uh, get this bird in the air. We have, uh, looks like it's uh, 22 satellites. This thing gets more satellites than the uh, ones did before. Um, our battery's uh, only 59, but I got another full battery. I'm just doing updates and stuff like that with his moving files over. So, uh, anyhow, we, we want to come down quickly, too, and uh, you would change, uh, for, uh, you know, from uh, regular photo mode and this is saying over to lock so uh, maybe uh, it's right in front of us we're going to take off right off the landing case there all right folks it looks like we have a good uh, solid hover here it's a little bit of wind here but uh you know, not too bad today. It's always kind of gusty around the beach. And we do have some big waves out there, so maybe we could check some of these uh, high waves here. So uh, um, that's screen recording going now. And you see how it's the overexposure worrying those lines on the left-hand side of the screen is showing me we're overexposed. So what we're going to do here, we're going to go to the uh, EV button, and we're going to take that minus down. See how I took it down to minus 7, took most of them away. One took them all away. So, But now I'm kind of in the shadow of the board. So we're going to play it in the middle here. We're just going to go the negative 07 here and, and help with the exposure here a little bit. So, okay, let's do a Marcus Crawford style, uh, you know, kind of up and out of here. So, here we go. Okay, folks, I'm going to change my EV uh, back a little bit. It's a little bit too dark up there. All right, so, okay, we're out. We're kind of over the ocean right now. We're looking back towards the bay in, in Longport there. So, um, let's keep going here. I'll angle it down so you can see the ocean a little bit better. There we go. Okay, we're we're you know we're up about 200 feet now. It's, we don't need to be that high. Let's come down to about 200 there. All right, let's get rid of that EV panel off the screen there for right now. Huh? Go away, EV. I don't know why I can't get that to go away now. Well, let's keep it up. Who who cares? So what's uh okay. 
here I'm looking towards the direction there. There's Atlantic City up in the distance there. You can see uh, the tall buildings. In fact, uh, you know, uh, I'm doing uh, I'm doing five uh, K, so I, I can't zoom in for you here with the five K. But if I if I was a four K, I could zoom in there real good for you. But uh, I already have another video where I I zoomed in. So okay, let me y'all around here again. I've got my I think I've got my settings dialed in the way I want to here. So what's um, Let's fly down here to the, uh, this is called the point in long port here. This is the end here. So we got a lot of clouds going on here. So let's, uh, let's drop that EV just a little bit there. Let's just drop the O3 there. And uh, let's, uh, let's fly on down that direction. We're using the autofocus here. Um, A little beach down there. So over the distance is the um, Long Park Bridge over to Ocean Sea. So we're getting a high wind warning here. We're probably up a little high here. So let's drop it down a little bit. And look, there it goes away. We'll keep it down about 180. So um, that helped a lot. Okay, so let's uh, let's get this in our crosshairs over here. We got the rule of four thirds up. So let's fly towards that sunset over there. We may not have a good sunset when it gets low. It may go behind his clouds, and we may not have a good one today. But uh, you know, it's you never know when you're out here. Alrighty, so we're getting to the end of the island here. I'm going to show you something here, folks. If you okay on the upper. Um, right hand side here um, you see that AF button let me turn that to um, manual focus it's already uh, putting the uh, things I don't think you have to even do that let's go back to autofocus again let me just hit something distance there like say this ground here let me get that focus point okay see how that focus point up now that focus box okay I'm focused kind of infinity there but see that little sun before I can like lighten or darken the um, you know the exposure in the shot there by just going up and down with my finger there. So that's a good tip if you want to light or something, dark something up if you don't want to use the EV button. So, um, I didn't record any of this, darn it. So let's, let's record backwards since we didn't record going out. I put a new battery in the um, in the Air 2S, and um, so I got a full battery here. Now we're going to switch over to um, doing a uh, log profile. We were on normal color profile for now. We're going to do log. We're still going to continue on with the 5.4K, 30 frames per second. Um, and I don't know if you've seen this in a previous video of mine, but here is um, these, a sled, a landing sled for the, uh, the Mavic 2 series. I got this for the Mavic uh, Air 2, but it, it fits the Air 2 perfectly. What does this op it offers you a few inches of, of ground clearance here, which is great here at the beach because you've always got some sand around or whatever. So this gives you just a little bit more clearance, especially if you can't land on a landing pad or a real safe uh, you know, uh, location. So um, yeah, so I just want to show that off to you. I have a previous video where I do a whole review on it. So, um, if, you know, check my channel out, and I'll probably link it to this, you know, if you want to see that video. So, um, you know, so we're going to go off for our, take off for our second flight here. Uh, kind of a full, I don't think any of these batteries are full, but uh, kind of full. And why I take off on that case there is because uh, these, metal, these cement walls seem to have metal, and it seems to affect the, uh, you know, the compasses in these drones, uh, unless you get a little clearance there so um, okay but no further ado let's get this bird in the air oh and also you 
good news too. You know how you could hot swap the batteries on the Air 2 where you, you know you could put a new drone in and only turn the drone off. You don't know, turn the uh, controller or the app off. Same thing here. So it's good news. All right, another successful takeoff here. So uh, here we go. We're gonna, we already did an up and out, so we're not going to do one this time. I've got my uh, settings down there. I got my yaw and all that set the way I like it down. See how I got it slowly turning there, but I have to go into cinematic mode or anything like that, you know. So all right, so here we go. Thank you. 